Good afternoon, LC people. Yep, I've been a bit quiet again, I know. Well, the last time I posted... In fact, I just think I put it on normal Facebook. I didn't post it to the groups. I got this LC to strip. Uh, I've got the crank and barrels in the box already there to send to PJME or Grampian Motors. The guy's going to come and see me Monday. Um, his loom was in a terrible state. He's had uh, a fully good wash. I've gone through all the joints on it. I've done a few repairs on it. It's been wrapped up. That is good to go. Uh, this said it's not very big. And it's soon getting filled up. Got a set of M1 clocks in there. Uh, if anybody's interested, PM me. Um, I'll take 350 for them. And uh, that's what I want. I'm in Loughborough. So what's Dave been about today? I went with my mate Phil Ardman um, to an auto jumble, car and bike auto jumble, just outside Leicester. Been a few weeks ago and got a few juicy bits for the right money. Went again today. Um, Phil had got some stuff for sale. He got some. He's got some Mark One LC three fifty barrels for sale. You'll have to PM about that or PM me, and I'll give you his number. Um, he's got a few bits for the LC. What else did he have? Um, He's got some um, stainless egg speeds for sale. Again, you'll have to PM him, they're brand new. And a pro -am, uh, nose cone fairing as well. A reproduction one, obviously. If anybody's interested in them, PM me. I don't know the prices, my apologies. What did Dave buy from the Auto Jumble? That little bit of kit there, believe it or not, with these two packets of belts, 15 quid. And it works, bargain of the day. Another guy, he got a box full of Yamaha, Suzuki, Kawasaki and Honda fixings in a box. 20 quid. That was a bargain of the day. I'm sure there's going to be some uh, rusty gold in that box of bolts and nuts and fixings. But a little soldering iron, 3 quid. That works. The linisher works. I actually came across a NOS um, stator for an LC. Guy didn't know what it was, it was selling it. I'm not going to say what the price was, you'll be amazed. Anyway, my mate Gail Hillman was there selling stuff. An LC oil pump, just what I needed. A few other bits and bobs, so I've done a deal. He had the stator and I had these bits. The pump we wanted 80 quid. And uh, yeah, there's some other bits and bobs in there. So I was happy with that. Uh, Koj Cat's on holiday at the minute, and a guy sent me an F2 loom on here. And I needed a couple of blocks anyway. I uh, come across a set of clocks, they weren't LC. But that little doll in there is identical. Mile per hours that'll be going on the bay. I'm not telling you about that. Um, it'll be 120 quid. I've got to get a face for it because the face is faded. Other than that, that's paid for today. I bought these, uh, this loom, don't know what it's off. Uh, it's probably something else, but KJ Cat are away, and this four block there is the block I need to repair that F2 loom. So win win. I don't know what the barrel's off. Look at that. So I gave the guy 25 quid for a set of clocks, yummy clocks, and this little box of goodies. So yeah, Dave spent, but yeah, I got, I got some decent deals. So guys, get out to something else other than Stafford and other than Newark. Go and visit these other ones because the prices can be a bit better by a long way as long as you know what you're looking for. So Dave's had a good day this morning. Uh, guy's happy with his stator. Phil's made a bit of money and he's still got some LC bits. So yeah, that's what Dave's really been about. The guy's coming to see me Mondays having this back, this frame and the wheels and other bits. Because he's a painter and he's going to do them himself. Other than that, folks, that's all I can really tell you. It's been a, an interesting morning. Yeah, an engine down there to rebuild when I get these crank and barrels done. Uh, and that's it. That's all I can tell you for now in Dave's little world. Um, yeah, very happy with the loom. The guy will be very pleased. Anyway, folks, I'll keep you posted about Dave's journeys and adventures. Thanks for watching Dilly Dilly.